What's good, YouTube? Bruce Rockman, aka Mr. Rock God Fitness, coming at you with a supplement review. So, all of you know that a few weeks back, yeah, about three weeks back, I did an unboxing video on Man Sports package they sent to me, which was Aso Minos and Peptis Bonk. So, as promised, it's a few weeks later. A few actually means three. Fun fact. A few weeks later, so I decided to sign for a review. Let's start with the pip test box. These will be done in a separate video, so watch out for that. So, what can I say about the pip test box? Let's start off with the flavor. Tiger's blood. If you like pina colada, if you've ever had a pina colada, virgin or alcoholic, either way, it's pretty much spot on. Flavor, profile, brilliant. Only thing I can say about the flavor is, I'm not sure if it's the caffeine content, or what but it's very grainy even after you've shaken it up and all that there are still bits left and then on that last sip it's terrible that's it's very a very very grainy pre-workout but yeah that's the taste next we've got the supplement facts okay so basically it says serving size is one scoop which is eight grams like i say i weigh out all my pre-workouts this is the thing though one scoop is eight grams, but it's got 400 milligrams of caffeine. Now, if any of you are close friends of mine, you'll know I respond very, very well to caffeine. Literally anything 160 milligrams and up will get me going. I mean, a monster gets me going in the caffeine sense, not that other sense, you dirty people. But yeah, for so I only took like half a scoop, which was four grams. Now, the effects I felt of the pre-workout. I loved the pump. I loved the vascularity it gave me. And I loved that crackhead feeling for the first half of the workout. Second half of the workout, still had that caffeine craze feeling, but I literally thought I was going to die. Not in a bad sense, it's literally like you give your all. You During the workout, you go so hard because you've got so much energy. But at the end of the workout, I just, I crashed. I think that's because it's too much caffeine for me personally. My one friend, Morris, for example, he'll take maybe a scoop or two scoops of this and he'll feel nothing. Reason being because he has a high caffeine tolerance. Unlike me, I've got a very low tolerance. So, as I say, each to his own. But otherwise... You've got your diaspartic acid, your, R, your agmatine sulfate, and your IR energy blend. Blah, 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 blah. I'm talking about personal feelings. I don't care about the scientific nonsense. All I know about is beta alanine, caffeine, and citrulline malate. And I think it has that in here. Let's see. Well, it's got caffeine malate. Citric acid, natural, yeah. But just to sum it up. Peptis bulk, buy it if you are very, very caffeine tolerant. If you like pina colada for the tiger's blood flavor. And if you really want that crackhead feeling, you'll have high energy, a good pump, good vascularity. Obviously, the leaner you are, the more vascularity you will show, maybe. Genetics plays a part in that. But overall, a good pre-workout. Only thing I would give it a thumbs down on is the graininess when you shake it. But yeah, a rating out of 10, I'd give this a 7.5. That's the distinction in university. So yeah. So guys, next review I'll do is going to be on the ISO Mino. But I'll see you in another video for that. Cheers.